The eyeball was the event for the ocularly obsessed. Time for the family to take off their glasses with she who taught them to see. Grandma Ida, mother of matriarchs. Ida had recently employed a butler named Igor, who eagerly catered to Ida's every appetite and whim. The eyeball wasn't exactly a ball, more a pretext for the family to polish their skills at the altar of their idol, Ida. A time to indulge their fixation on fashionable frames. And to view their most precious heirloom, the first glasses Ida ever made. Priceless, irreplaceable, the mesmerizing stuff great optometry dreams are made of. <coughs> Pilford pinched purloined. The glasses had been nabbed. Who would do such a dastardly deed? Did Igor just have eyes for Ida? Or designs on her designs? And if the butler didn't do it, who done it? It was time to call in the hounds. The pack caught the scent. And off they went. When cornered, the culprit calmly confessed she'd borrowed the specs for a night on the town. With the hounds. It's always the quiet ones. Georgetown optician. Our family knows glasses. <laughs>